realistically, having a full-time athletic trainer in a rural New Hampshire school is, uh, is just not going to happen. I've lobbied the school board uh, for several years to include a, a nominal amount of money uh, in our athletic budget for a part-time trainer. The board did it include uh, money in this year's budget for a trainer. Hitchcock was able to, to provide us with, through their outreach program, uh, with, with Molly. Oh, that's better. It's a commitment on both the hospitals and our board's part in terms of getting our kids the best coverage we can in a district where funding is, 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 is a challenge. Oh, that's way better. So I do have uh, several responsibilities as part of my current role um, as an athletic trainer, physician extender in sports medicine. Um, I see patients in the clinic with Dr. Ames, um, as well as assisting him in surgery. Um, but one of the most fun parts of my job is I get to come out um, to the high school here to Mascoma. We're almost four months into your rehab. I'm excited to see what you can do here today. Now let me see you do single leg. Good, don't let that knee drift in. Um, I have an injury clinic one afternoon a week where things um, can kind of be checked in, anything that's happened um, with any of their athletes that maybe they want some advice on um, or want some treatment for, or want to get started on some um, basic rehab things. Am I all set? Yep. Let's go back. Good. Basketball, I just sprained my left ankle at the beginning of the season, so I was out for a couple weeks and um, Molly has been very great in helping me out a lot. She's been seeing me once, about once a week, giving me exercises, checking up on me. For years, we've, we've existed without an athletic trainer and on numerous occasions have uh, had to rely on our local uh, ambulance crew. With Molly, our kids will get uh, immediate, professional, uh, experienced uh, care uh, from a certified athletic trainer. It's really fun that I get to do this sort of traditional um, part of athletic training of attending events and, and being the on the front lines, so to speak. Just having Molly here, I wasn't, I didn't have to go to the doctor. She was able to tell me exactly what was wrong. They really made this a priority to be giving their student athletes um, the best health care that they could and really provide for their safety while they're competing here at Mescoma. That's a huge um, show of support from the community and the administration as a whole and uh, I'm, I'm glad that I get to be part of it and be the first.